After their crushing defeat at the mining facility, the Battle Droid Army is back, with more tanks than ever. General Grievous, after seeing Asajj Ventress's crushing defeat, has joined the battle, dual-wielding lightsabers. But Commander Cody has landed on the planet with his 212th Attack Battalion, ready to swoop in and save the day for the 187th. He's also brought with them an ATTE tank, a devastating blow to the Separatist attack. What's going on guys, it's your boy Daily here, and today we are on episode 3 of our mining facility, Fortress Defense. The Battle Droid Army is back and bigger than ever, bringing tanks into the facility. This took some time for them to organize off of the capital ship over here, but they finally managed it with the help of Grievous. The 187th veterans are still holding out this corridor in the same positions that they were in last episode, along with their E-Web turret line that we sadly didn't get to see used, hopefully we will see it used today. But they've got a little bit of reinforcements coming in from the 212th after their distress signal was answered, so hopefully they can hold out. We are going to be going into a part four on this series. I thought it was just going to be a trilogy, but it's gone beyond my expectations. So we will have a part four depending on the outcome of this episode. Let me know what you guys should think happens in the part four at the end of the episode. It's going to be a doozy. If you guys enjoy this video, please be sure to hit that like button. Subscribe with notifications on. We're so close to 600k. Well, in the grand scheme of things, we're still like... <laughs> 80k away, but, but still, uh, and comment down below. Let's get into it, baby. What's up, gamers? I'm here to tell you about Instant Gaming. Instant Gaming is an amazing place where you can get some fire deals on all sorts of video games. Uh, seriously, it's like 60 to 95% off, as you can see here. Uh, these are all of the Star Wars titles they have. They literally have every Star Wars title. Uh, you can also get XCOM here, Men of War Assault Squad 2, all of the games I play on the channel you can buy here for extremely cheap prices. If you use my affiliate link in the description, it helps me out a ton. So thank you guys for listening to this sponsorship and thank you to Instant Gaming for continuing to sponsor the channel. Alrighty then boys, we're gonna go ahead and go in slow-mo and press start right now. We got Hellfire Droids, we've got a super tank, and we have AATs on the battlefield here coming on forward. A really good smackaroo to that Hellfire Droid and it is a one-shot kill apparently. I thought it would get its silo out before, but no, okay, maybe putting these in the front lines was a mistake, I'll, I'll, I'll admit to that. Hopefully this one can get its silo out, nope. It stumbles, falls, and is about to get hit by a rocket, and it is dead as a doornail. Oh dear god, okay, the super tank does have a silo within it though, so maybe that one will fire well, I don't know. The AATs are currently firing though, that's a good sign. We like to see that, is the ATTE by the way in range? Whoa, actually. I think something sent out a missile because it wiped out half of the E-Web turret line. Oh, this will never do. We need to see that line in action. Folks, go man those. Oh, nope. They are dead dead. Okay, never mind. Two E-Web turrets down from five. <laughs> That's a bit of a yikes there, Chief. Definitely a little bit of a yikes. The droid infantry was hard locked in this position in the previous battle. This time around, they seem to be doing a whole lot better. Let me unclip the camera position here, and we can zoom in. Hopefully this corridor does get some kills for the clones like it did in the last episode. There we go. Already one droid dropping right there. Uh, but over here, this kill box that we saw last time around is not so much a kill box anymore. But over here, we are seeing that. Very good. Okay, lots of droids funneling on in here. This could be very dangerous. Clones, get some grenades out there. Get some grenades out there. Nope, they're distracted over here. Oh, this guy's got a grenade. You didn't, you didn't skate it, baby. Throw that thing. He's not doing it. Come on. He's just. Oh yes, 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 yes. Throw it. Beautiful. All right, good stuff. That'll distract those droids, but the clones aren't going down. In the meantime, that's no good. That also wasn't that great of a grenade placement, which is not super duper helpful. Oh no. Okay, wait. Maybe this is. Oh, this is gonna be good actually. They they prepped forward. Oh, that one droid's body blocked the damage from going out to the rest of the droids, which resulted in just a singular death right there. Okay, this area is now getting absolutely curb stomped by the battle droid army. The droids, their reinforcements, they ended up being able to do big things right here with them. Uh, the ATT is still not really involved in the battle though, and I don't think the 212th have really come in yet. 
No, they're like trying to rock climb here. Oh my god, they are way up there. What are you guys doing? They're oh my god. They're trying to get into, you know, the high ground. Obi-Wan has taught them very, very well, apparently. Okay, still no Jedi Masters on the battlefield. I want to save that for the last episode, so potentially next episode might be the last episode of this. Um, at, at the very least, I think next episode we will have the Jedi Masters in here. Oh, we should check what Grievous is doing. Grievy, baby, what you up to? Uh, he's just chilling. He's just having a day in the real time. I'm going to take a sip of my tea real quick. Mmm! It is scorching hot. Um, that's good, though, because it burns all of the ouchie off of my throat. <laughs> I don't know if that's a scientific thing that actually happens when you're sick, but it is what it is, so it's very nice. Feels very nice. Very good. All right, more droids just lurching on forward here, but we are coming upon the first of the clone trooper outposts, and I think this is where things are going to get very, very devastating for the droids. These outposts are going to be where the... Clone choke points are going to come into play, and we're going to see a lot more droid deaths. All right, let's bump it up to normal speed here. By the way, I really hope... Actually, that's a little bit laggy. Let's do it in two speed. Uh, I really hope you guys are enjoying these videos, by the way. I, I think uh, th they've been really, really fun for me to make. We haven't done these sort of trilogies in a long time, even though this isn't going to end up being a trilogy. Uh, but we used to do them all the time. Oh, Grievous enters the battlefield, hits by a rocket. He's not dead, he's just down. Um... But yeah, I mean, I, I gotta do these more often because they are super duper fun. Oh, Revis is back up here. This guy put away his rockets. He should take him back out. Toss that DC-17 aside. Take out the rocket launcher and hit Grievous again here. Because Grievous could disrupt this whole thing. Alright, this guy's actually kind of slinging with the pistol, though. He's got three kills. That's not too shabby. Grievous going off into the corner right here. Meanwhile, the droid's trying to bum rush in and help Grievous out. But they are just dying in mass here. All right, Grievous, this one guy is working on Grievous. That's all we got right now on Grievous. It's gonna take a bit more than that. A couple of clones are dying. dying. The rocket trooper is gone. We got a jet trooper back here. He can fly out of this situation if he wants to, but he's gonna stay behind because his boys are in peril and he needs to help his boys out. Okay, overwhelming the clones here. That is what is currently going on, but still more droid kills are coming through, which is all we really care about. Oh, how did this guy get in here? I think they're phasing through the wall or something like that. It's a pretty common glitch in this game. Uh, but it seems like these clubs are dealing with it in, in stride. Oh, God, here comes Grievous. Oh, God. At least some damage is being done to Grievous, you know? At least he's not full health anymore. He, he is a little bit damaged. Oh, my God, these droids. Bro, bro. This rocket trooper is doing nothing. He's just standing there. Oh, there he goes. Okay. Uh, the first area is not fully done done yet. There's actually still four clones right there. Um, but, I mean, a, a solid defense for the start right there. Look at that. Look at that. Red are dead droids. Yellow are dead clones. That's beautiful. That's what we wanted to see. Even though it's been basically capitulated, that is exactly what we wanted to see. Is a massive blow to the droid infantry. Alright, there's still a super tank and an AAT out here. This AAT is doofing back here. Let's go ahead and bring it back this way. Um, I think it's stuck, actually, so let's go ahead and reroute this thing. I These tanks are really stupid. Actually, it might be damaged. It's not moving at all. Okay, well, if you can come over this way, come over this way. Let's unstick these boys so they can move as well. There you go, just removing the obstacles so they actually get involved in the battle, and we'll see. They might just be out of the battle. That's how droid tanks tend to go in this game. That's how all tanks tend to go in this game. If the AI is controlling the tanks, they're bound to do a horrible job. An absolutely atrocious job, so it is what it is. <laughs> but at the very least, we got plenty of droid infantry here. Oh, they did wipe out this area. Did Grievous go down for good? Is that a dead Grievous? No, he is not dead. Uh, he is still very much so alive. He's just concussed. I think a grenade went off uh, and concussed him. A couple more droids did end up dying in this area. But that's about it. That's about it right there. We do have a Z6 rotary cannon right here. Rattling off some shots. We like to see that. It's going to be maybe a portion of time before the droids really get forward here. ATTE though. With the smackdown. Where are the, where are the 212? 212 are all up in here. What are you guys doing? This is ridiculous. All right, let's. Since we re-geared some of the clone, or some of the droids, we'll re-gear some of the clones and actually get them into the building. This is what I'm talking about by the AI being absolutely stupid. They go stupid. They go goofy. So I'm not entirely sure what they're doing, but 
the 212 at the end of the day was supposed to be coming in this way and actually like assisting in the battle you know helping that is not what they are doing right now they are being bozos right now okay get in there <laughs> hopefully they actually do something with that and aren't just stupid all right this ATT cracking shots taking names if droids even have names I guess they have serial numbers so there's that <laughs> But it's good stuff. It's good stuff from that thing. What is going on with you? Why can't you move forward? Why can't any of these tanks move forward? Here, get get involved in the battlefield. There you go. I swear, sometimes they're so stupid. This is supposed to be partially a tank. Oh, dear God. Oh. Oh. As I was saying, this is supposed to be partially a tank battle. It's good to see the tanks actually getting involved now by brute force. <laughs> Here comes a 212. They're moving forward. Oh, jeez. They're trying to uh, gain some ground on these droids, which is good. Honestly, the droid infantry is getting really, really beaten down. These droids are having some serious trouble. Look at that. I mean, there's still a lot of them. But they are, they are definitely having some serious, serious trouble in the business right now. In the business. All right, what are these clones going to do? Keep pushing forward, boys. Take back the center. Actually, I think if they push forward, they will die. I think they will go down pretty badly. Let's go back into normal speed here. I think the lag has subsided enough. Enough enemies from both sides have died so that the lag has gone down a considerable amount. Which is excellent. Okay. Big shot from an AAT. There you go. Now the tanks are actually moving. Another AAT way back here actually dies. Um, I, was was the ATT irresponsible for that? I'm not entirely sure what killed that thing. But I'm impressed nonetheless. Way to go, boys. And the super tank runs into a wall. I swear. I swear. Oh, the other AAT is coming back, though. The other AAT is coming back, though. We might still have a tank battle. It's destroying all of these bodies, so we won't get a good representation of the amount of dead on the battlefield, but that's fine. Look at this clone fire output. They're losing a few, but like, this is good output right here. This is what we like to see. Taking another sip of the leaf juice. Whoa! This thing just Tokyo drifted into the... I've never seen a more reckless driving in this game. Then this tank right here, Tokyo drifting into this thing. It's actually kind of brilliant in a weird way because it is resulting in half of its body being consumed by a wall, meaning the clones aren't able to get as good of output on it, and it is just free firing into this ATT. That is a beautiful, beautiful thing right there. Surprisingly, shockingly, that droid tank is doing big things in a very strange way. In a very very strange way all right the clones that push forward right now are suffering dearly from their mistake but i think we still yeah we still got the rock climbing droids way up here these boys are still chilling uh, there's still a few back here being stupid as well why don't we go ahead and get these guys in here because they're just doing nothing and these guys i think they won't do anything in this battle because they don't have an angle to actually shoot from so they're in there they are on retreat mode they can move backwards if they want they just seem very cocky and don't seem to want to so there's that all right we're gonna reman the top of this thing because we have given the droids some advantages we're gonna give the clones some advantages and reman the top of this thing please don't die immediately okay he's he's still alive he's still alive boys Beautiful. We still got plenty of 187 troopers. Still got bazooka troopers too on the battlefield. I'm pretty sure we should. Yeah, there's a bunch back here. Should be a bunch back here too. Uh, Tethos is still back here. There's Tethos, the Teeth Man. Um. Uh oh. You hear that? Sirens going off in this puppy. That's never a good sign. Never a good sign. There's Grievous. There's Grievous. Are you guys all stuck in here because this droid tank blocked off the, the entire area? Oh dear God, what is happening? This is pure and utter chaos! Ah! <laughs> My goodness. This is some craziness. Alright. Taking a sip of the leaf juice. Mmm! She's on fire now. She's on fire. She's gonna go down soon. She's got no more shields! Her engines are on fire. It's only a matter of time. Still getting kills, though. Still getting kills, though. Yeah, she's... I didn't survive that, Jeez. 
It had four chevrons, meaning it probably had like 80 kills or something like that. Which is kind of nuts. Oh, look at this! Clones got real close over here. Look at that. They're phasing through the walls. <laughs> they just gut punch that guy. Oh my god. Alright. Seem to be at a stalemate. Let me go ahead and fast forward a little bit. Going into fast speed. We're the fast boys now. I think this thing has gotten itself purely stuck. The droids are trickling out a little bit now. Uh, they're getting slaughtered as they go. Clones kind of have them trapped in this sector. Pretty decent grenade from the droids right there. Didn't result in much, but I like the idea. There's Commander Cody! He's healing up. Good, good idea. Keep up. Why don't you have your DC-15... Or, sorry, DC-17 out instead of your DC-15A? What are you doing? Bozo behavior! Take that out. Yeah. Pick, pick up your DC-15A. There you go. There you go, Cody. Actually contribute, Cody! My god. My goodness. Alright, let's fast forward again here. Alright. Yeah, the droids seem to be trickling out and dying now. So the clones seem to be doing quite well. Oh, Cody. Oh, Cody. He just exploded. He's now in this barrel. Dead. Ripped to the man. Oh, Cody. That was stupid. You did a bozo move. Rip bozo. SMH. Dude, the droids have so many units. They still are super plenished in units. Is that is that a correct term? Because you can replenish. Can you just be plenished? I'm bringing up these droids from the back lines. Oh my god. Joe Grievous is back out there. Oh, he got grenaded. He's getting tossed around. He's still alive. He's just unconscious. He's getting full fired on, though. Look at that. He's probably going to go down pretty soon. Taking so much heat. <laughs> oh, oh! Bit of a push from the droids there. Clones still maintain their positions though. Oh my god. Alright. Another area where the droids are just getting getting trashed. So I think if the clones are gonna win this one, which I'm pretty sure they are going to, then what we'll do, the last fortress is up here. This is like the main bay area. So I think what we'll do is we'll have the clones retreat the last of their forces back there. And they'll go meet their Jedi Generals. And the droids will have one last push before they give up on this whole venture. Because at the end of the day, it has cost them greatly over the last two battles. The first battle went great for the droids. These last two have not gone so great. Not gone so great in the slightest. Oh! Rocket smacks Joan Grievous around yet again right there. My goodness. How did you get yourself all the way in this post? How are you all the way in the outpost right there, dude? That is ridiculous, donk <laughs> Like, why are they worming their way in here? Oh, there you go. He just, he just killed some of his own men by running them over. Did you hear that little, oh, that's when they get run over. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. They really are taking like block at a time. They are not managing to move much farther. In the space of these episodes, they moved one block, two blocks, and now the third block is still just holding out. Still just holding out. General Grievous trying his best to do something here, but I mean, like, at the end of the day, he's just deflecting blaster shots. Not really amounting to much. Oh, there's a Z6 here. No wonder the clones are doing so well. Alright, this Z6 has seven kills. This guy has six. This guy has four. This guy has seven. This guy has three. This guy has one. And this guy has three. Uh, this guy has five. This guy has three. This guy's got none, and this guy's got none. Alright. There's also a clone over here who has zero kills. Fun fact. Alright, why don't we go ahead and bring up some of these bazooka troopers. Bring up some of these bazooka troopers. We'll put them over here, and they can crossfire into the super tank. Since it's trapped right now, it's basically running out of infantry cover as well. Oh, God! All right, it pivoted and killed them very quickly. All righty, then. Um, got any more bazooka boys? We do. Come on up here. Come on up here. Plop you down right here. Try and work on this thing a little bit more. Try and take her down. Because that's what we need. Oh, God. <laughs> Check your weapons. And it just keeps wedging itself in this corner. So it's not really effective. It's just kind of chilling. Um, I have to sneeze. Okay. 
Uh, I mean, I'm not really seeing much else. Uh, all right. I really have to blow my nose. Why don't we go ahead and just let this play for a little bit, and I'll start recording if anything interesting happens. Okay, so over the course of the last few minutes, the super tank actually ended up going down. It is dead. Um, as you can see, you can't really, like, select it or whatever. This AAT is still in here, but it's trapped now because of the super tank. It, like, literally can't get out. See? Uh, and then there's just a droid in General Grievous here. And then one droid way back here. So let's retreat General Grievous and the one droid. Uh, and we'll have them return in the next episode. Uh, the clones still have a sizable portion of their soldiers. As you can see, they've got like 50 or so left. Uh, and Captain Tithos himself is back here. So we'll retreat them. They'll gather the wounded. Uh, they'll, they'll gather their armaments. And they will be in this fortress back here in the next episode with their Jedi Masters. And uh, we'll have a, a, a jamboree. It'll be very fun. <laughs> Either way, guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. Let me know what you think should happen in the next episode, too. We can always add more stuff. Uh, and, yeah, let's check out the losses real quick here, though. Uh, yellow are dead droids. Red, or sorry, yellow are dead clones. Red are dead droids. Lots of them got deleted. As you can see, there's weapons but no bodies because of the tanks moving around. Uh, but there are still lots and lots of dead droids, as you can see. There'd be, like, double, probably. Yeah, there'd, there'd be, like, a lot more. Look at, look at all those. Look at all those. Um, but yeah, the clones put up a nice fight here. Either way, thanks so much for watching. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and comment down below. I'll see you on the next one. Peace. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Be sure to click that subscribe button for more content, and hit the notification bell if you'd like to be alerted to whenever I live stream or upload. Thanks so much.